Hey, what's up, guys? It's Legend and Navi. Welcome back to another video, and I haven't posted it in a while. Um, part of that was because I was on vacation, but another part of that was my channel. And then finals is like in a week, so I have been studying a lot for that. Um, but yeah, I just haven't really been posting on this channel a lot, and I probably will not post on it a lot. Um, but just because of my other channel, once that gets started up again. Um, but anyways, I'll leave a link to that if you guys want to check it out. Anyways, this video is going to be about this, which is the SNES Mini, which I finally got. And we actually got it in California also. So basically, there was an Amazon store, and we went into it, and there was two of these left, and we got it. So I think it was $70, and... I have played it a little bit already, and it is really, really fun. I love these classic games, like, uh, actually, I'll just show you guys. Hopefully, you guys can see that. So, those are all the games. If you guys do want to pause it, uh, that might be a good idea to look at all of them. Um, but Star Fox 2 also is included, which was never released, so that's pretty cool. Anyways, I'm going to be taking it out and, like, showing you guys it. Um, so, I have already opened it and played it, but we had to pack it for going back home, so let me just get this out, if it will come out. Okay, so basically it just comes with instruction manual, which nobody reads, and an HDMI cord, which was really nice, so you don't have to go buy one or use one and then this is the charger which is just micro usb i guess it looks like or no it's just the power i guess not the charger it doesn't charge but anyways those are like the cables and all that stuff now let's go to the main system and it is really small which is nice um and basically those are the ports there so there's an hdmi port and then a micro usb and then let's see just the, all the stuff on the front and so basically the power button you just switch up and down to turn it on and stuff and then this reset button if you're playing a game um, you can just do that it will reset the console and then you can save your progress which is really nice and there's actually four slots for each game so um, I do like that they added so many slots but anyways to plug the controllers in where's that oh yeah so basically there's like a little have thing down here and you just pull it and then you can plug the controllers in and they look like nunchuck uh, stuff from the Wii so I actually will get the controllers out alright so it does come with two which is nice because the NES classic only came with one um, and you had to buy the other one so that kind of sucked uh, even though I didn't get one, I know a lot of people were complaining about that. Even though there really isn't any multiplayer games for the NES. But, uh, yeah, this is the this controller now. I'm guessing it's probably the same size as the classic one, or the original. Um, I don't know why they would not make it different. Um, but there is the controller. The buttons are pretty nice. I feel like they might have, could have made these a little bit more clicky. They kind of are, I don't know. They don't feel super nice, but they're not bad, and they're definitely fun to play with. So yeah, it does come with two of these, and yeah, it just says Super Nintendo. Um, I really, I don't even know if they released one, but they like the classic colors, the yellow, the red, and the buttons and stuff. Those ones are really cool. I'm pretty sure these are just the North American ones. Um, but yeah, so basically, these are nunchuck little cable things so they're basically the same as the nunchuck and then you can just plug them in and start playing and it really is easy to set up and everything and really fun to play all the games on this um i have started uh legend of zelda link to the past on this i'm pretty sure that's what it is <laughs> on this console um i know i did do a series but I might start the series again just because I can actually play it on a console instead of a computer because that was kind of boring um, and hard to play. Um, but yeah, that is the SNES Mini, which I'm really excited to start playing again. So, 
Um, I would definitely recommend you to buy it if you do see it in a store, just because it is so rare to get, and um, it's just really fun to play uh, with people. Like, there's Mario Kart on it now, so it's really fun. So, some of me was what I got. I got three, actually. Actually, I got four. I'll show this one first. I totally forgot about it. I got Wedding Mario, and I just opened it because I do plan on using it. Um, but I do like it. Uh, I like the white. It's kind of like a pearly white, so it's really nice. Um, but yeah, that is the boy Mario. <laughs> and I also got this 8-bit Link. And I feel like this one is definitely going to gain value over time just because um, it's just like so big and bulky. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, that's the 8-bit Link. I do like that one a lot. Here is Rivali, one of the champions from Breath of the Wild. I think this is probably my third favorite one out of the four. Um, but I do really like this one. It has a nice bow. And then the last one that I got was probably m is my favorite champion, uh, Daruk. And there's so much detail on these, like, they do so much. And that's probably why they cost a little more than regular amiibos, because regular amiibos I'm pretty sure are 12, and these are 15, or 16 I'm pretty sure, so... Yeah, that is Daruk. So yeah, I mean, that's it for this video. I didn't really have a plan, I just wanted to show you guys that I got this. Oh, one more thing also. If there's anybody watching till the end, make sure to comment um, if you guys want me to do some live streams with this because I feel like that'd be really fun. And also, I want to finish my Twilight Princess streaming series, so make sure to go check that out when I do stream. Hopefully, um, here soon. I probably... It's going to be tough to do, but I will try to. Anyways... That will be it for this video, guys. If you did enjoy, make sure to go comment, like, and subscribe. Make sure to subscribe um, if you want to see more of this. And, yeah, that's about it. See you guys later.